promise. Ladies and gentlemen, every night I come out here to the stage at the Ed Sullivan Theater. I spend a lot of time right over there processing the day's stories in my news lab, trying to develop uh, them into an inexpensive monologue based substitute for synthetic rubber. But sometimes I mistakenly mix the boric acid with silicone oil and accidentally discover a resultant putty of silliness that is stretchable and pliable, yet bouncing when rolled into a ball. And best of all, you can press it against a newspaper, and it picks up smaller stories, which I store in the little red plastic egg of news that is my segment. <laughs> meanwhile. <laughs> meanwhile. Meanwhile. It's the only thing stable left in this country. Meanwhile. Mattel has launched a gender-neutral Barbie doll, which is great news for representation, but not really necessary. Have you ever seen a Barbie doll without clothes? <laughs> They're already gender-neutral as it gets. <laughs> Ken is cut, though. Meanwhile, <laughs> in early Christmas news, meet the world's first kale-flavored candy canes. But the makers warn they might not have the nutritional value of actual kale. So if you want none of the taste of candy and none of the nutrients of kale, this is the confectionery nightmare you've been waiting for. <laughs> Meanwhile, renowned French chef Marc Veyra is suing the Michelin Guide after they demoted his restaurant from three stars to two because he says, Michelin's reviewer wrongly determined a cheese souffle as having cheddar in it, adding, they dared to say that we put cheddar in our souffle of Reblochon <laughs> before and Tom, uh, you have insulted our region. My employees were furious. <laughs> uh, listen, monsieur, I would give anything for this to be my biggest concern right now. Which brings us to our new segment, French People Problems! <laughs> the life of a Frenchman is a life of pain. <laughs> Today, my brie is too cold to spread on the cracker. <laughs> and that is just the tip of my iceberg of ennui. My local mime wears a shirt with stripes that are... vertical. <laughs> Join me next time when I tell you how my poor wife cannot find enough lovers. <laughs> this has been French People Problems! <laughs> We'll be right back with a performance by Brittany Howard.